First of all, I'd just like to say that this map looks beautiful. Just look at this place, man. It is literally a one-to-one -one replica so far of the original Die Rise from Black Ops 2. And you must be the last zombie, my friend. See you later. So where are the parts for the trample steam? There's usually a flag right there. I can't remember where else it spawns. I guess there's a part right there. I think it's time to get the M14 since I've got five bullets left. And here's another part. Where's the other bit? I can't remember where it spawns. It was literally in front of me the whole time. Can you jump down here? I can't remember, but I also don't want to risk it. We are missing one bit for the trample steam. How is there this many zombies spawning on round three? It's right there. Death machine on round three. I'll take it. And there's more. We're going to keep you. Now you can't despawn. See you later, sucker. I guess it's not see you later, sucker. Good morning to you, my friend. Where's the key, man? Is it on here? Where's the key? All I can see is needles and trash. Okay, I found it. Does the bank still work? Oh my gosh, it actually does so if i put that in there i can then get it out there and now i've got 100 less i see you power that's what i could hear the whole time dude that was getting so annoying we have power my friends no way that spawned right here what's here is the real question bruh really i thought it was gonna come up i've just got another part for the slick fire dude i just want to go up to the roof ah can i have juggernaut yet is there any more guns around here i actually can't remember i also can't remember what any of the parts look like for the slick fire so this is going to be a fun little adventure dude come on you know what i'm gonna use the elevator key you don't even care here we go yeah man oh i'm about to get absolutely ruined worst perk ever i can't even get on it right now i'm gonna die i'm dead no i'm not no i'm not not yet not yet oh man i'm still alive why am i going down what are you doing there i have a feeling the zombies are just gonna jump on here oh my god are we going all the way to the top already the best camping spot ever what's up bro wow it's been a while since i've been here a good few years at the very least i feel like this jump should not be made right now but i'm gonna do it anyway and now we have the trample steam see you later suckers where's the box wow this map is confusing where do i even go right now and now i go this way the glove of knuckles wow been a while since i've seen you as well the nostalgia overload right now is nuts i can't even jump there what am i doing this was my favorite gun of all time in call of duty black ops 2 apart from the ballista i used to love that thing with an absolute passion the best training spot of all time is here can i use my trample steam to get across to there i mean i'm presuming I can. And we've got another teddy bear. Where even am I? Juggernaut. And I'm guessing that's mule kick still. What's this perk right here? Oh, I'm back where I started pretty much because this is the power room. Like I said, guys, it's been a long, long, long time since I've played Die Rise. So please cut me some slack and don't roast me in the comments. But if you do have suggestions on what maps you want me to play, feel free to drop them in the comment section down below. And I'll try my best to get round to every single good suggestion that is made. Where are the rest of the perks? I think there's some perks over there, actually. Let's get some of those. PhDs in this map as well apparently please work i hope it doesn't shoot me all the way down there thank the lord wait i don't even need to go this way what am i doing oh elevator hello another part where was that i need to get one more part for the sliquifier now and it looks a little bit like a sock where do i find that part is it in here please go down i just want to get on there and go up to the top come on bro nice well hello there and we're going up we found the bag of bunch. Whoa, look at that. Now that, my friends, looks pretty. This looks amazing. Just look at the camo. I was just expecting it to be the Black Ops 2 default pack of bunch camo, but this is way, way better. I need whatever perk is in there, please. I've just got the golden key, apparently. Speed caller, we need you, but not right now. This map is awesome. So the way I got the map is I decided to support these guys on Patreon with the maps because they're also making transit remastered and all sorts of other remastered maps from the old Call of Duty and bringing them to Black Ops 3 with really good quality of life modifications and just an overall overhaul of the whole map but keeping the map as original as possible. As you can see this map is the original. The only difference is this looks fantastic with the 4k textures. I mean just look at this. This looks amazing. It just all looks amazing. Guys I just need to ask you a question real quick as well. So I've had some guy comment on my videos especially my most recent ones saying that I speak way too much but that's what a cut commentary is. I've also had people before saying I speak too fast and things like that i just want to know your guys opinions on it because this is literally who i am as a person and i'm not going to change my content for a few people that don't want to watch i need speed caller bro if the team that make the map end up watching this video are you thinking about adding perma perks to all these maps in the future
future. I don't know how difficult that is to do, but I was just thinking if I get a collateral headshot with this, then it gives me the perma perk dead shot, I think. I'm just wondering that's all because that's something else to look forward to, even though we've got so many things to look forward to anyway. I also can't wait for the transit reimagined. I've seen screenshots of that, if it's the map that I think it is. Thank you very much. And now I need to get back over there. This used to scare me so much. If I hit that and go down, then it's game over. Oh yeah, I've got to go around. I am actually so autistic. Where's the box? Double tap, yes please. Thank you very much. Whoa! Have I got to go down in this elevator to go back up? Genuinely can't remember. It's been that long. Hello, my friend. Just look at this. Tell me this does not look amazing. What's in here? I know you've heard this in my other videos, but I hate this perk with a legit passion. Oh, I know where I am. The feeling you used to get when you put your gun in and then the elevator goes down was so soul crushing. It has left a permanent stain on my brain. But that doesn't mean that the nostalgia isn't here. The armored zombies as well also have the same health as regular zombies now. And as for the crawlers or whatever you want to call them, those things that used to jet about and if you only kill them with the knife then you get a perk at the end of that round. They are going to add them into the game apparently but they want to make them more customizable. More customs a better word to use. That is so blue. The MP5, just like the original, you are what I need because I need to get over there to the box. I want to see what weapons we've got. Can I go down there? I don't really want to do that though. I feel like there's a much quicker way to get there. Please just go. I need to get on top. What the hell? And we found the last teddy bear. Say something to the microphone then. Happy birthday, dear kidney boy. Why do all of these look like parts, but they're all just not? Okay, then. Does it actually kill them? Did they just fall and die? I'm a bit confused what's happening. Should I just start shooting them? PhD slider and banana clada is a thing in this as well. There's also one, I can't remember what it's called. Vigo something, I can't remember what it's called now. Just gives you incendiary rounds. So just like I was originally gonna do, let's hit the box and see what other weapons are in this map. Wow, the original Galil. Oh my God, the scar. This thing in multiplayer was absolutely nuts if you literally just stuck a suppressor on it. It has no recoil at all. Proceeds to show the most amount of recoil that gun has ever made. An RPG. Why do I want this? Now, this gun was an absolute beast in multiplayer. We got the foul. This gun was good as well. It sounded awesome with a suppressor, which I obviously can't put on it right now. We've got the RPD as well. Wow, what an absolute beast of a gun. This is absolutely awful. Now, that is a cool gun. I've got the M16 for old time's sake. This was my favorite gun to ever exist in Zombies. You know, when this was on Black Ops 2 back in the day, I would sit at the roof and just sit there for ages. I wonder if the pack a punch is here like it usually is. No! I'm gonna guess that it's over there then. Yes, it is. Look at this camo. This camo looks sick, man. I've seen the variants as well with this camo and they look amazing. Let's give it a try. Now that looks cool. The Grimace gun! Can I put a variant on this? I actually can. This is not the best thing I could have done, I'm gonna be honest with you. This was really not a smart decision. Shall we see how long I could just camp here? We've got the box. We've got the pack a punch. Life's good. Why are they floating? I wanna pack a punch this, man. Leave me alone! Give me the gun. I can't get it. I can't get it. I got it. This one has the grenade launcher on too. That's awesome. And it's fully auto. Wait, why has it not got a camo? Well, that's just weird. And the grenade launcher actually works. I have actually never pack a punch this gun or even made this gun until today. This is a good, good day, my friend. I was going to jump on top of there to get to the top. I'm so stupid, man. You know what would be cool as well? If they put the steel barriers on, like what we used to have in Black Ops 2 as a perma perk, that would be cool once all the maps come out. The hardest thing in the world was keeping this barrier shut while shooting these guys. This is literally what I used to do with the AN-94. If me and my friend were playing, then one of us would cover the barrier and the other one would just spray the hell out of these guys right here. And before you ask, yes, I did skip it to round 30 because I wanted to get some actual action in this video instead of me yapping and yapping and yapping even though that's what i do anyway let's get a little train going i don't know how well this is actually gonna go though because if we're gonna die we're gonna die in some emphatic fashion boys and girls i keep forgetting i've got phd slider and banana colada Ooh, i've not seen that for a while how to get yourself unsurrounded 101 so does this instantly kill them what's the bit that kills them is it when i fire at them i'm a bit confused here yeah i guess it is when they fall let's watch i'm trying to watch man so if i shoot this all over the floor how does it kill them oh okay then let's just cover the whole floor and see what happens. I think after this round, I'm just gonna put myself in a corner and spray this to see what happens. It's time to go down in history for the most exaggerated death of all time in Call of Duty Zombies. I didn't mean to do that. You can't get me. Nah, 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 nah. I've just got to make sure I stay in this corner because I'm sliding all over the show right now. Can you imagine if I get to round 50 just by doing this? Although I've got no ammo on this gun at all. Yes! Get in. That's just what I needed. Bro can't even get me. I think I've got myself in a bit of a situation right now. The zombies are pushing me out of the way. What? Why won't they just die already? Ha ha ha, you fell over. I feel like this was a bad decision. Oh no! Oh no, 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 no! Am I meant to see the map like this? 